Hey there, and welcome back to On Your Terms. I'm your host, Sam Vanderweel, and I am so excited to dive into this episode today because in it, I shared with you the backstory on the Ultimate Bundle, my signature product that gives you all like the legal templates and trainings that you need if you're an online business owner to run your business legitimately. But I also wanted to share it with you from the perspective of somebody who has like tinkered with something for years and years and years and has been so passionately dedicated to making this product the best it can be for all of you and really has been like a healthy obsession i think for for me to to build the ultimate bundle and to uh, with it build my business over the years and i wanted to share it with you not only as a source of inspiration but really so that you can take what i'm sharing about how i approached the building of the ultimate bundle the beta testing the re-tinkering the the scaling of it to apply to what you're doing in your own business, the development of your own products and programs. So I'm really hoping that you'll take a lot away from it. You might have also heard me mention in this episode that we had a special sale going on at the time. Don't worry, if you missed out and you listened to this episode and you're like, man, I wish I would have known about this sale, just send us a DM. Send me a DM on Instagram at Sam Vanderwillen or shoot me an email, sam at samvanderwillen.com. Say, hey, I listened to episode 61. I'm ready. I want the ultimate bundle. We'll make sure we'll honor that discount for you. No sweat. I want you inside the bundle and I want to make sure that you get what you need. So you might hear me talk a little bit about it. That's what was going on, but no fret. Dive in, learn the backstory of the ultimate bundle. Tell me what you're going to apply to your own business. And you'll also hear me dive into the details for any of you who are interested in like what is included. What do I get with this? Is this for me? Is it the right timing for me? Do I really need this? Can I do something else in the meantime? I dive into all of your burning ultimate bundle legal support questions for your online business. So let's tune in to episode 61. So before you understand how the Ultimate Bundle came to be and ultimately how it came to also be my best selling product, I have to share with you a little bit about how it was born, because first of all, it's going to help you, I think, think through some of the products and services that you might be offering now or something that maybe you've got in the back of your head. But I also always want to be so transparent with you about how long things take, how things like evolve and what you're seeing is like chapter 28 of many, many chapters that have been written and torn out and tossed in the trash and then written again and all that kind of stuff. So I always want to give you like the full pictures that you really understand. How do I think through these things? How did I mess up? How did that help me? What has gone well? All that kind of stuff. So hopefully you know already that I'm Sam. Hi. No, I'm just kidding. (laughs) So hopefully you know that if you're listening. But I was a corporate attorney. And when I was a corporate attorney, I always, I mean, my whole life since I was a kid, I loved food and cooking. Really cooking is like my main passion in life. And when I was a lawyer and I was so burnt out and I was so miserable, I would just think, man, it would be so nice just to do something with food and just to teach people about food and cooking. Really, I wanted to focus on teaching people how to cook. So it started out when I was a corporate attorney that I started like a little food blog called Barrister's Beat. And I was like sharing recipes that I was making. Like I had no time to cook. I was working a million hours a day. I was eating most of my meals in the office. So I was trying to show people like, look, here's how I cook. And then I bring stuff to the office, Um, use glass, blah, blah, blah. So I was was doing all that. And then that morphed into like, hmm, maybe I could actually go get some sort of certification in this. And to me, at least at that time, like 2015, 26, yeah, 2015, um, health coaching was still so foreign to me. I had never known anybody who was a health coach. I hadn't heard of it. I think that because I fa- I followed so many food bloggers at the time, I started to then become aware of it and see like all of these people who are out doing this as a career. Um, and so I registered for a health coaching program, became, you know, certified through this health coaching program. And I think about a year after that, I, I decided, and I've shared some about my personal story, but I've shared that, like, I finally was like, I'm going to go do this. Right. It was a series of events that, that led me to that, that I won't go back through now had to do with a plane incident. I won't make you listen to that again, but I decided to go and become a health coach. And I started this business in 
2016, becoming a health coach and offering private coaching. I had a group program. I tried to start a course. I had all kinds of freebies and downloads. And I really immersed myself, I would say, in like the culture of online business. I had no idea about anything like email lists and landing pages and like pixels. I I never heard of any of these things. I wouldn't have say I was a techie person or like very tech savvy. I obviously had never built a website as a lawyer or anything like that. But I started doing all this stuff and I fell head over heels for the work that we were doing. I actually didn't really like being a health coach. And I've I've shared the episode. I'll, I'll link to it below about like 10 things, 10 reasons why I think my health coaching business failed, why, why I know it failed. Um, one of which being like, I just figured I just would model it the same exact way that everybody else was modeling their health coaching business at the time. And therefore it would be successful. And it wasn't, but it also, I didn't like buy into it. And that really came through. So when I really had like hit another wall of being like, man, I really thought being a health coach was going to be the answer to all of my problems, right? If I left the law, I was super miserable at being a corporate attorney, working in a traditional job. If I just leave and I start my own business, everything in my life will just like magically fall into place. And boy, was I like disappointed to find out that that's not really how it works. I don't think that's how it works for anybody, let alone that was definitely not my situation. And it was during that time that I realized I got to shift again. I have to do something different. And people would not stop asking me legal questions. People were asking me when I would go to conferences or when I would teach a workshop or even online, what's the deal with an LLC? Like, what do what, what kind of contract do I need? Do you know anybody who does this? And I was just like, man, why are people asking me this stuff all the time? And I realized during that time period, I really needed a little bit of space from the law. But I realized during that time period yeah, like, of course, of course, they're asking this because the traditional stuffy old legal field that I was working in just, you know, months and like a year prior, they wouldn't know what to tell you to do about a coaching business. They wouldn't know what to tell you to do about a podcast, an email list, a TikTok account, a YouTube channel. They have no idea, right? They're not using any of that stuff. They don't know the language. They don't know if they don't know how you're using it, then how do they know what to do to tell you like what you have to protect, right? So it kind of started to click for me. Like, of course, on top of all of the things related to like it being really intimidating to go and speak to a traditional lawyer, it's also really frustrating to go to one who doesn't understand what you do so you don't leave feeling very confident. They can also be really condescending, right? And of course, this is not all lawyers. There are many good lawyers, but like I saw a lot of this kind of behavior in my experience. So it all started to click for me and That's why in early 2017, I started a legal templates business that I thought was going to be a little nothing. I was like, this is my kind of final hurrah. If this doesn't work, I'm going to have to get at least a part time or some full time job that's outside of online coaching. And then I'll see what I want to do. I was really upset about it, but I was like, you know, let me just give this legal templates thing a go. The idea was I would just start selling digital legal templates and then I would create SEO driven content that would consistently drive traffic to those templates. And that's exactly what I did. Right. Those were my first several, you know, dozens, hundreds, whatever of sales of individual individual legal templates. That's that's all I sold at that time. I then added in these free connection calls so that people could figure out what templates they needed because I realized I was getting all of these emails from people saying, I don't know which template I need and I didn't know how else to do it. In those free connection calls, though, people were asking the same questions over and over to the point where I would joke with Ryan, my husband, that I could just record the same me saying the same thing pop the phone down, put it on speaker and walk away and like have these conversations with people. And like, it was such a waste of my time. And I remember complaining about this one time, just being frustrated that I was saying the same thing over and over and over again. And then realizing you dummy, this is on you. Like, this is you. This is not a them problem. This is a you problem. Why are you offering something in a way? If you're saying the same thing to people all the time, there's a better way to deliver that thing. Right. It doesn't have to. I don't have to be on the phone with thousands of people explaining the same thing. I can do that through like a video that they then purchase access to. I realized in those connection calls, too, that it wasn't just about buying legal templates. Right. So somebody might need a contract. Somebody might contact me and say, all I need is a contract. But then we got talking and they were like, wait, 
I need to register my business. I thought I could wait till I made ten thousand dollars. I was like, no, 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 we can't do that. And then they would say, well, wait, what happens if I get sued? And I'm like, well, don't worry about it. I mean, if you have the right business insurance, it won't even financially impact you. And they were like, what's business insurance? So I started realizing that there was this this thing outside of just a bunch of legal templates. You don't just need legal templates. You need, first of all, trainings that are completely on target for like what you're doing, right? For offering courses, for creating content on social media, for building an email list, for having a website. You need stuff that's specific to what you're doing and how you're doing it. And you also need some support along the way. So this stuff started to click and I came up with an idea for a product called the ultimate bundle. This has been years and years and years now. And at the time I had the brilliant idea that it was going to be two different versions. There was going to be a version of the ultimate bundle that was just the trainings, just those little video trainings of, of essentially me breaking down what I was saying to people on those calls. And then there would be a version of the Ultimate Bundle that included those trainings plus the templates. I thought this was a brilliant idea. I was like, okay, I'm going to go beta test this. So I contacted a whole bunch of people who had reached out to me, who I had free calls with, who were, you know, maybe I was communicating with through social media and said, what do you think? Do you want to buy this for a couple hundred bucks? You'll be a beta tester. This is going to be more expensive in the long run. All I ask is that you use the product and tell me honestly what you think. And if you like it, then you offer me a testimonial. I made them sign something that was saying that, you know, in exchange for this discounted price, they would give me feedback. Didn't It didn't have to be a positive testimonial. If they didn't like it, I just wanted the feedback. But I wanted something from them, you know, so that I can prove it. And in doing so, pretty much everybody came back and said, I absolutely love this. This is so helpful. Everyone needs this. But the only way I would ever buy this is if it came with the templates, because it doesn't make sense for me just to get trainings. I need the contracts. And there was just this like, aha moment where I was like, right, of course, you need both, right? You need both. Just like how on the phone, I realized it wasn't just the templates that they needed. It also wasn't just the trainings. It was the marriage of both that really made the ultimate bundle, as I had conceptualized it, special and unique. And nobody had anything like it. There was nothing like it on the market. So we were like, I was like, there was nobody working for me at the time. I was like, okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go with just this one option because I'm a big believer in really trimming down the options for people. I really think people shoot themselves in the foot when they offer lots of different like variations and levels of things. And like people get overwhelmed with decisions and they will always take the road least, you know, like complicated, the cheapest, the fastest, whatever. So I went forward with just the ultimate bundle, 10 legal templates. At that time, I think it was 23 legal trainings. Um, You got access to the Facebook group, all that kind of stuff. And I started selling it right away. And it was like maybe one or two bundles a month, then like two to four bundles a month, then like five bundles a month was like super consistent for a while. I remember $10,000 was about the limit I could hit for like bundle sales. Plus I had my legal templates and I was like, wow, this is incredible. And then, you know, five became 10, 20, 30, 40, blah, blah, blah. And it kept going and going and going over years, by the way, this took years, years and years, lots of trial and error. To the point now where it sells like hotcakes, it sells very consistently. It's my top seller. It has been now for years and years. And this product, I am very, very grateful and fortunate to tell you, has sold millions and millions and millions of dollars in product just for itself, right? So it's an incredible product that's been built over a long period of time. It's been built with a lot of feedback involved and that I have improved, right? So it's not been a stagnant product for me. It's something that I am going back to now my team is going into constantly and improving, adding more information, creating additional trainings, updating legal templates, all that kind of stuff. So I hope that walking you through that like little story of the ultimate bundle helps you to first of all, see that these things take time, but also maybe even think about, you know, the, the kind of the mindset that you take towards a product that you might be building or that you might not be satisfied with at this very moment that it's something that should be evolving. And it's something that you're going to have to continue to tinker and retest and test again and adjust and walk back, test again. Right. But this, like, I think it's been like an obsession for me in a, in a healthy way, in the way that you can have healthy obsessions 
to just like pour all of me as a business owner into this and making it the best experience possible. I have lots of podcast episodes where I share more with you about kind of my approach and the way that I treat customers and how much I think that's helped and and like how I've approached the marketing for this product, how I beta tested it in way more detail. So we'll link to all of those episodes um, for you below. But I want to also dive in for you about what the ultimate bundle is right now, because first of all, it's on sale right now. But second, I know so many of you are interested in it. So many of you have questions and you might say like, I'm not so sure still if it's right for me, if I need it now, if I need all of what's in it. So let's like dive deep for a couple of minutes into what is the ultimate bundle? What's this product that I just told you all about? So the ultimate bundle is my signature program that gives you the most essential legal templates like contracts and website policies, for example, and trainings that you need to start, build and scale your online business legally. More informally, what I always like to tell people is that the ultimate bundle, the way that I designed it and conceptualized it was that if you had known when you were in school that this was the kind of thing that you'd be doing for a career, this is the class that you should have taken, right? This is all the information that you wish you had in your back pocket as a business owner so that you knew exactly what you needed to do in any given scenario. So I created the bundle as a way for you to have any question like, oh my gosh, this client just, you know, skipped on her invoice again. What do I do? You can go into the bundle. There's a training on what to do if people don't pay you. And there's also information in the contract templates to try to make this, you know, problem go away or not happen as often. So I really wanted it to be that like business BFF that was like sitting next to you. Anytime you had a legal, some financial questions that you could just pop in there and get what you need. That's why the Ultimate Bundle is not a course. It's really more of like an on-demand, like a knowledge on tap set of resources and legal templates. Anytime you want to learn about something, have a question or concern about something, or you don't know how to navigate something on the legal side or financial side of your business, right? So who then is the Ultimate Bundle really for? So we literally have every single type of coach that you can think of. It's not only for coaches. I'll go into that in a sec, but We have business, health, fitness, mindset, career, life, love, money, self-care, literally every, there's there's probably many others. We have every kind of coach that you can imagine. We also have lots and lots of service providers like RDs, Facebook ad strategists, NTPs, Uh, We have tons and tons of like health pros who are trying to create a coaching business. Like we have nurses and therapists and doctors and we have lawyers and CPAs who are then trying to create a coaching business side of their, you know, profession. We also have a lot of creative service providers like web designers, copywriters, designers, that social media strategists, that kind of stuff, right? Now, not everybody is all online. We have a lot of customers who who see clients online or they sell a course, but they still see some people in person. So you can do both, but the bundle is not that helpful at this current moment for you. If you only sell physical products. So if you sell like mugs and t-shirts on Etsy, you sell art or something like that. I think it's incredible. I applaud you for being so talented, but at this very moment, we don't have a bundle for that. If that's something you'd be interested in, make sure you send me a DM and let me know that you'd be interested in it because I want to talk to you. It's also not super helpful for brick and mortar only people. So if you own a bakery, please send me something that you bake. But it, unfortunately, the bundle is not for you, right? So we can't help people who have just a brick and mortar business. When is the bundle right for you then, right? So now you've maybe said, okay, that sounds like I fall under the kind of person that this would be helpful for. This all sounds interesting. But when am I supposed to get this stuff in place, right? So we have people join the Ultimate Bundle at literally every stage of the business building journey from the beginning to people who are already making seven figures in their business. But I want to speak to you if you're a little earlier on in your business journey and you're like, I don't think I need this yet, right? I want you to start thinking about the business that you're trying to build, not the one that you have this moment, because you don't get legal protection for what you have this second. 
You get legal protection for the things that you're trying to build and to offer. And I think if we're being honest, if we can just like, can we be honest? Can we be friends for a sec? We are friends, but like, can we talk like friends for a sec? If we're being honest, a lot of what happens around this this topic is that you are hedging your bets to see if the business turns out successfully or not, right? You're like, if it's successful, then I'll go and get my business registered or I'll get a legitimate contract. But until I know it's successful, I'm going to use a crappy contract or I'm going to roll the dice and go without any protection. Two things are happening there. One is that if you have the mindset already that something may not work out, you're you're giving yourself an out. You're giving yourself a plan B. And whenever you have a plan B, you are not going to fully commit to plan A. I really believe that because that was me when I was starting this business, this legal business. The like first six months to a year that I had this business, I was like, well, if this doesn't work out, then I'll just go back to being a lawyer. And I kept all my lawyer clothes and I was like keeping in touch with my contacts and all of that. I wasn't buying in. I wasn't jumping in and I wasn't killing it. I wasn't doing amazing in the beginning. Right. And I remember I I went to this conference and this coach had said to me, you are you've got too much of plan B in your mind. You're giving so much energy and focus to plan B that you can't commit to plan A. And you're never going to pull this off. If you keep saying that there's an out, if you have one foot out the door, you're never going to be all in. And I went home from that conference. I got rid of all my lawyer clothes. I like stopped interacting, going to these miserable lunch meetings that I didn't want to go to. And I was like, I am going all in. I'm giving this an honest go. So I really do believe in this, that if you keep saying like, wait, I'm going to wait to see if this thing works out, you're not jumping in, right? The second thing that happens when you don't like get legal protection early enough is that you will kind of stay in this circuitous pattern of like, I can't put myself out there because I'm afraid that if people see me or hear me, I might get sued. I might say the wrong thing. Somebody might not pay me. I might accidentally do something wrong, right? And so you don't put yourself out there and you kind of keep your business small and hidden and quiet. And then because it's like not being super successful, you're not making a ton of revenue or anything. You're like, well, I can't invest in legal yet because I don't have this stuff. So do you see how that could continue? Like the lack of legal stuff could actually be making it worse for you. Right. So that's kind of my spiel on like when you get legal protection. I believe like the earliest that you can do it the better. Um, That's great for you. It's also fine if you're like, wait a minute, I've been working with people now and I don't have this stuff. Well, it's better now than not, right? So let's just get it done. I don't think there's much use in spending any time being like, I don't know like why I didn't do this earlier. So let's just move forward. So that's what I think about the when thing. If you have any questions about whether or not it's a good time for you, shoot me a DM on Instagram at Sam Vanderweelen or send me an email, sam at samvanderweelen.com. Um, let me know what concerns or questions you have. I am happy to help you and to, to go through that with you. Let's, though, talk about what really is inside of the Ultimate Bundle. What is it, right? I don't know about you, but like when I buy stuff, you know, they always say like, don't focus on features when marketing your product. I'm like, I am very interested in the features. I always want to know like, but what is it? What do I get? So with the ultimate bundle, you get 10 DIY legal templates for me. So what that means is that you get 10 of my essential contracts and website policies that are downloadable. They are fill in the blank. They're super easy for you to fill out. The only thing that you're filling out are your personal details, like your name, your business name, your address, stuff like that. You're not doing any legal writing. I've done all of that for you. Here are the 10 legal templates that you get inside of the Ultimate Bundle. The one-to-one client contract templates for all your client services. The course and membership contract template. The group program contract template. The website disclaimer template, which goes on the bottom of your website, protects you for liability for what you say and do on your site. The privacy policy template, which you're legally required to have on any website or if you run Facebook ads. The terms and conditions website template. Your affiliate contract template for you to run an affiliate program. A mini disclaimer template, which goes on your freebies and handouts or even at the bottom of your posts and captions. The independent contractor contract template. That's for either you to hire contracts in your business or If you're doing something in your business where you're acting as a contractor for someone else, then you can use it for yourself. I actually wrote it in both ways. 
Last but not least, you get the testimonial release template, which is what you send to clients to make sure you can legally share their kind words about you. So those are the 10 legal templates that you get. Not, that is not the only thing that is included with the Ultimate Bundle. You also get support from me in two different ways. So you get support from me in a private members-only Facebook community where you can post your questions, but you can also post and ask things of the group, which a lot of people do every day. You can also search the entire group for the archive of all the thousands of questions that have been asked already. You don't have to use Facebook, though. So if you don't use Facebook, I get this question a lot. You always still get support. So inside of the course itself, we house um, the Ultimate Bundle inside of Kajabi. And inside Kajabi, you can actually leave comments directly on the trainings or the templates themselves, and I respond to you there as well. You also get over 35 trainings that are broken into seven modules. They're meant to be on-demand videos, like as you need them. They are not to be all digested in like one sitting. This is not a course. You're not even meant to necessarily watch them all if you don't need them all. They're broken into seven modules though. So the first module walks you through forming your business. It teaches you about LLCs, sole proprietorships, EIN numbers, how to get an LLC, how to act like an LLC if you already have one, which is like a crucial misstep that I see a lot of people make, all that kind of stuff. Module two goes all into money and business insurance. So I teach you about creating a business bank account. I teach you exactly what you need to do to set that up, what questions to ask, what to look for in an account. I teach you all about business insurance and exactly what questions to ask a business insurance agent. Everything related to money and business insurance is covered in that module. Module three, I teach you about how to legally protect your website, how to legally build an email list, and how to legally, you know, carry yourself on social media, especially when it comes to things like scope of practice. So we talk about, you know, what you're legally allowed to do as a coach, for example, or if you're like a nurse who's trying to start a coaching business or a lawyer who's trying to start a business business, like then you need to know what can I do to protect my license, all that kind of stuff. I go into all of it in that section. Module number four, I teach you all about contracts. So I teach you how to send and sign contracts properly so that they're actually enforceable, which contracts to use. But this is also where I go into like what to do if the client doesn't pay you, how can you work with minors if you can? How do you get minors to sign contracts? All of that is in module four. Module five is all about working with clients. So I go into the legal issues that come up most often in different um, client and customer scenarios like one-to-one -one coaching, group programs, courses, memberships, stuff like that. Module six teaches you all about copyrights and trademarks and how to legally protect your content. I also have a training on there of what to do if someone steals your content and what to do to make sure you don't accidentally become the copycat yourself. Last but definitely not least, module seven, which is the newest module that's been added to the ultimate bundle, is all about legally scaling your business. So in this module, we talk about things that happen as your business grows. So we talk about hiring. What's the difference between hiring an employee and an independent contractor? Affiliate programs, things like S-Corps. When should you become one? What is an S-Corp? All of that kind of stuff is all addressed in module seven. Also, though, included inside of the Ultimate Bundle portal in general are all of my favorite resources like business and some personal resources. I also give you all of my professional recommendations for accountants and CPAs and business insurance agents and lawyers and all that kind of stuff. I also include a lot of business tips throughout the trainings because I feel like my kind of signature style when it comes to teaching you about legally protecting your business is not just like do this or don't do that. It's like yeah, do this to legally protect your course. But like, by the way, have you thought about marketing it in this way so you make more sales? So, you know, so I talk, I talk a lot about business, the business side of things inside of those trainings. Last but not least, you also get lifetime updates of the Ultimate Bundle. So I keep it updated. And not only do I update the trainings, but I update the templates, the legal templates themselves, like the contracts. And you get all of those updates included for free. So the way that it works is that if there's a change or if I discover an error or there's a new update in the law or something like this, I update the legal template and then I email everybody out and I let them know that there's been an update to that template. You also get lifetime access, so you don't have to worry about like, am I going to use this all right away or I'm not ready yet because you get lifetime access. You can come back to the Ultimate Bundle as many times as you need. We don't cut you out. We don't even cut you out of the Facebook group. I have people who've been in there for four years. 
We also include some pop-up events and add-ons. So throughout the year, I mean, none of this is is guaranteed, but like throughout the year, we have offered many different um, pop-up events. I often include the Ultimate Bundle members in live events that I do. Um, All of that is included for you when we do it. And last but definitely not least is that you also get the monthly Ultimate Bundle member newsletter. So every single uh, month on the first Wednesday of every month, you get a newsletter from me with additional resources, tips. I let you know about any updates, anything that's going on that you can join for free. Um, I let you know about it all there. So to recap, those the 10 legal templates, the support from me, the over 35 video trainings on demand, and broken into the seven different modules that you don't have to watch all of, (laughs) the lifetime updates for free, the lifetime access for free, pop-up events, and the monthly Ultimate Bundle member newsletter. So there's so much inside the Ultimate Bundle. Um, The cool thing about getting the Ultimate Bundle during the sale is that you have access to a longer-term payment plan that you will not have access to once the sale ends. So it breaks it up over 12 payments over the course of the year so that you can access the Ultimate Bundle for starting as little as 197 today, followed by 11 additional monthly payments of that 197. So that's available. You can also save by paying upfront in full. You get an additional bonus. All that kind of stuff is available on the page that we'll share down below that has all the details about the ultimate bundle. Um, I know that some people have asked me questions recently, especially with the sale that we have going on. So I wanted to, um, I wanted to go over those quickly. A lot of people will ask, like, do I still need to hire a lawyer if I buy the bundle? So you don't have to hire a lawyer. I mean, a lot of people find that this is a a great like middle ground for what they need right now. I always think just like an accountant, it's great to have a lawyer who you at least like initiate a relationship with so that if you ever had an emergency or a question or you really needed legal advice, you could get that from them because I can't give you legal advice because I am not your lawyer. Even if you buy the ultimate bundle, I am not your lawyer. So I will not tell you like, yes, do this or no, you can't do that. Or like, you should choose this option. I can't do that. I can educate you about the different options, but then you have to choose which one's best for you. So you don't have to hire a lawyer, but you could. I do always say it's great if you can have somebody review your contracts. I think that's awesome. It's just that I created this because a lot of people don't have, you know, that option. Um, It's going to be a lot more affordable for you to have an attorney review contracts that you've prepared and you bring it to them, have them quickly review it and sign off on it um, versus having them create any kind of contract from scratch, which would cost thousands and thousands of dollars. A lot of people also ask me if they can have a sneak peek of what the Ultimate Bundle looks like inside. If you're like me and you're very visual, I just sometimes need to see stuff like no matter how many times people explain it to me. So I'll include a link below for a sneak peek of what the actual bundle looks like inside of Kajabi so you can see exactly what it would look like if you purchased. A lot of people ask if there's a payment plan. Yes, there are actually two different payment plans, like I said, but the one payment plan, the most affordable, is only available during this sale. So you'll want to take advantage of that. You might also be wondering like how much time it's going to take you. So I designed the legal templates for them to each be able to be completed in 15 minutes or less. So again, let's remove the overwhelm. You only need to go in and get into the bundle and do exactly what you need right now. And I actually have resources for you inside of the bundle. I have like a roadmap for the for the success of the ultimate bundle for you to like nail the success of the ultimate bundle. And I teach you like if you're here, right? Like if you're just starting and you haven't done X, Y, and Z, do this, this, and this. If you're here, do this, this, and this. So I break that down for you right when you sign into the ultimate bundle so that I make it super simple. My goal is not to overwhelm you, not to be like, oh, you need a million things. You have to do a million things. You're busy. I get that. So I want to make it really simple for you to get in there and say, okay, I can just knock out this stuff. So it doesn't have to take you a ton of time. Somebody asked, if I don't have a client yet, should I wait until my business is bigger before I buy this? So no, I think we've already talked about this and there is no get out of jail free card for not having a lot of clients and doing something wrong legally. Wrong is wrong, unfortunately, and the judge won't care that we're new to business, right? But I also think that the cycle of like waiting to get legal in place until you're bigger, but then not putting yourself out there because you're not legal is like, uh, you know, something I would give some thought to. And I, I definitely talked about that uh, you know earlier in the episode. 
I had somebody ask me if this was a course, again, if it was going to take a lot of time. No, it's not a course. Hopefully you know by now. It's really a pack of legal templates that you get additional trainings with that are on demand. So as you have questions, you can hop in and you can do that. So I hope that this breakdown of the Ultimate Bundle um, was helpful for you. I'm so excited that we've got this sale going on right now. It ends so soon. Um, So we'll have all the details below in the description of this episode. Make sure you check it out. If you don't get my emails already, make sure you sign up for my emails below so that you can read more about the Ultimate Bundle. And if you have any questions about what we've talked about today or the bundle in general, the best thing for you to do is either send me a DM on Instagram at Sam Vanderweelen or send me an email, sam at samvanderweelen.com, and I'm happy to help. I hope to see you then. Thanks so much for listening to the On Your Terms podcast. Make sure to follow on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you like to listen to podcasts. You can also check out all of our podcast episodes, show notes, links, and more at samvanderweelen.com slash podcast. You can learn more about legally protecting your business and take my free legal workshop, Five Steps to Legally Protect and Grow Your Online Business at samvanderweelen.com. And to stay connected and follow along, follow me on Instagram at samvanderweelen and send me a DM to say hi. Hi.